With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. If we talk about this question, this given question is a spring of in spring constant k is cut into three equal pieces. The spring constant of each part will be and the given options are k by 3, 3k, k or k by 6. Okay. So what we are given, suppose initially there was a spring. Okay. So let be spring which is having a length L and spring constant K. Now this particular spring is cut into two, uh, three equal parts. So let this one be the first part, this one be the second part and this one be the third part. Okay. So this is cut into these three parts. Now let the new spring constant of each spring is K dash. Okay. And their length will be L by 3 since this L part is, is divided into three equal parts. So the new length of each piece will be L by 3. Okay. And we know that for a particular spring, for a particular spring, the product of the product of force constant into its length is always constant. The product of force constant of the spring or spring constant of spring into its length is always constant. Now, for this particular spring, the product of force constant k into spring l is kl and for this new spring the product is k dash into l by 3 k dash into l by 3 and these two must be equal for a particular spring so from here i will be getting the value of k dash or new spring constant as three times of initial spring constant okay so k dash equals to 3k this is our answer so from these options option 2 is correct and rest all options are incorrect i hope you understood thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today